Hi, we're Stephen, Jess and Hunter, a full-time travelling family from Australia who spent most of 2021 living out of a van. And just a couple of weeks ago, we did kind of take a camping in winter and on the snow. I think we owe her a visit to the mouse house. Plus, we love going to Disney because um, who doesn't love going on roller coasters? I think Hunter is ready because we've been prepping her since she was a few months old. So, for the next two weeks, it's Disney World time on the channel with a new episode coming out every Wednesday and Sunday as we not only head to Magic Kingdom, but we also make our way over to Animal Kingdom, Epcot and Hollywood Studios for the ultimate Disney World guides, showing you some of the most unique dining spots, See, this is a very cool restaurant, experiences and honestly, we're just here to show you all a good time. So unlike the other parks here at the resorts, Magic Kingdom has a little bit more work to get into the park. We jump on a tram, jump on a monorail, then you're at the entrance. You say hello. And it's pretty cool because we are here during the 50th anniversary of the Disney World Park opening. <laughs> just enter the park and we've already seen a marching band, Mini Mickey Pluto. Hunter's already on a high. It's Pluto! Oh, he's your more interested in the horse. So the big difference we found from going to Disney in the past, just the two of us, to now going as parents, is that meeting characters in the world of total belief is so magical. And guess who's inside the door? Mickey Mouse is inside. So, a few months ago, Hunter actually had her first foray with characters in Australia. And let's just say it didn't go as well. But to be honest, she had no idea who Scooby Dooby Doo was. Yeah, okay, let's go say hi. Hunter, it's Mickey. Hi. This is you got your toy. Have you got Mickey Mouse toy? Should we get a photo with Mickey? It's going to be so interesting to watch over the coming weeks to see how Little Hunter goes bumping into a big colourful cast of characters. On the bubble. <laughs> she looks very tough. She's eating the sword. I think she's very tough. Okay, I think it's time for Hunter to go on her very first ride. The boat's gonna take us to find animals. Shall we go on the boat? Yeah, 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 yeah. So as you can see, I think Hunter fell in love with the Jungle Cruise ride. Look at the lion! She wants more elephants! Oh, no, it's not the elephant! Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
it, aren't we? So Little Hunters having a nap, so we're using this time, got a coffee and the cinnamon scroll that Stephen convinced me to get. All right, here we go. It's like the one time you can eat stuff like this because we are currently doing 20,000 steps a day. Ready? Should I bite an ear? Is it all connected? Oh, it is all connected. So they only got this for the 50th mm. anniversary. That's really good. Mm -hmm. So I guess you can only get it for like the next year or so, but there's glitter all over it. It's really good. The light in your eyes comes over me just like sunrise. You said a scene turning my gray skies blue just like you always do. Um, is that Mickey out there? Oh, is that Mickey now? When you wake up from your nap, to Mickey Mouse all past. Is it yummy? I ain't got no game to kick at the bar to a girl with an awkward occurrence on my talk. Oh, Hunter's chair? You want me to put some on Hunter? Okay. And. Wow! <laughs> Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Yeah. Wouldn't you think, Mom? What's the matter? Fish. Hi. 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 Hi, fish. guys if you're looking for a good spot for lunch so at the moment the park is so busy but if you come into the Pinocchio restaurant you'll see a little hidden staircase if you go up there you'll come out to this little patio there's plenty of seats available and you get the best view of the castle and the carousel I wasn't kidding it's literally just us and the view look at everyone coming are you gonna wave and say hi I can close my eyes again, but it's not the same. It's not the same. I hear you at the door, feet hit the floor. I come running. Hunter, are you wanting a balloon? Yeah, yeah. Should we get you one? Do you want? Do you want Mickey and Minnie? Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, this Toy Story. Mickey and Minnie. Okay. Oh my goodness. Wow. Hunter's got a balloon. Say thank you. Thank you. any of our theme park videos in the past so you know we usually go to Kluke to pick up all of our tickets and seeing as we're going to six different parks over the next couple of weeks we found it so easily to just buy it on their app we can easily connect it to the my disney experience and we're good to go in the park my So probably the biggest change that has happened at Disneyland and Disney World is this thing called Genie Plus. It's about 15 bucks a day and having a kid, it's the best thing ever because we can essentially skip to the front of the lines every two hours. So you just jump on the app, you can just go on there, see what you want to book, book it in and we just come back, enjoy the park, 
and completely skip the lines. We personally love it because we've been able to take Hunter on so many rides and not having to line up. Oh yeah, you guys remember our good friends the Grin series? Well, it just wouldn't be a Disney trip without them. So that night they flew in from Canada to give little Hunter a big surprise. So it is currently almost 10 o'clock at night and we're about to go home. Hunter is currently asleep. And then we're having a look and we saw that there was a table available at Be Our Guest. And we have always wanted to go here. I think Beck and Paul have been trying to get a reservation for the last 10 years. And we're a little bit disheveled. I think it's a fancy restaurant. We have matching Walmart t-shirts. But hey, take the shots you can take. So we're currently in the waiting room and just the waiting room itself. It feels like an elegant castle in its prime. We got suits of armor, carpet, fire going, chandeliers <laughs> hanging. It's gonna be a good dinner night. I'm so glad we could squeeze it in. This looks so cool, Steve. As you can see, it's set up to be snowing in the castle through the windows in the back, but it just looks like it's the ballroom scene from Beauty and the Beast. They've done a really good job. She's fallen asleep, but she wouldn't fall asleep unless she was holding her balloon. So look up. Really? <laughs> That is the fanciest Disney entree I've ever seen. Look at that. Can I taste yours first? So Stephen went for the octopus to start with and I went for the lobster bisque, but I have to try your octopus, Steve. It looks so good. Mm. It's like a cold lobster salad, hey? Like a deconstructed. For our mains, we've got scallops with some risotto. Oh, it's so good. It's really good. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, one of the main reasons I wanted to eat here is to try the grey stuff. To try the grey stuff, it's delicious. Are you ready? It's a dessert. So this one here, it's delicious. <laughs> Tastes like Oreo, like an Oreo mousse. It's yum. As good as the grey stuff was and our meal, nothing all top the twins' dessert that they got. It was a white chocolate chip shaped cup, complete with edible painting palette for them to decorate and devour. Now Chip has a chip. Look who decided to wake up right when we were leaving. Hunter, have you woken up in Belle's castle? She's so confused, it's like almost midnight. Alright, let's go home, Baba. It's pretty cool because our reservation was so late, the park closed an hour ago, so we're just like walking through an empty park all to ourselves. We're <laughs> nearly in the park, still holding your balloon. <laughs> this early before. Well, this is kind of cool. This morning, Stephen has booked us in to go and have breakfast inside the castle. So Hunter is going to be first meeting Cinderella. She's going to be trying Mickey Waffles for the first time. And we're currently in the park and no one else is allowed in right now. Everyone is on the other side of the rope. <laughs> it's cool coming inside the castle. <laughs> they made it like, it looks like you're in a real castle. Oh, yes. Please. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, she Are said, you ready to go have Mickey Waffles? Oh, yes. She's oh, very yeah. hungry. <laughs> okay, you can go right up the stairs or up on the elevator. Fancy castle. Awesome. Oh, oh. Hunter, do we show you what you do at a fancy restaurant? <laughs> you colour in, that's what you do. Hunter, you have to get your napkin and you go like this. Shake, shake, and then you put it on your lap. 
shake, shake, and put it on your lap. Does <laughs> <laughs> it look so pretty? Wow. Is that Mickey? You want both? You take them. You can take them. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Hunter. A wand and a sword. Hunter's been practicing her evil laugh. Ready? Mwah ha 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 ha. That's so scary. She's ready for the haunted mansion. Mwah ha ha ha. Dada's turn. <gasps> oh, that's so scary. It's going to be so interesting to revisit Disney World in the future when Hunter is older because right now she has no idea the Haunted Mansion is a scary ride and is just happy to make some new ghost friends. Have you really been to Magic Kingdom if you haven't been on the It's a Small World ride? Hunter's first time, ride of passage, has to be done. <gasps> Do you see the boats? Let's go! Oh. You need to learn the song, you ready? It goes, It's a small world after all. It's a small world after all. It's a small world after all. It's a small, small world. She doesn't know it now, she will by the end of this ride. Oh, do you see it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow! Mind is just like wow. Is it a ball? Alrighty, with the sun slowly going down on our final day at Magic Kingdom, we had to squeeze in as many parades and rides like, as party, possible. Party. too many rides because she is zonked and asleep so we thought let's get some hot chockies and sit down and wait for the fireworks show we have a pretty good spot so no matter how tired you are or how much your feet are begging you to go to sleep the moment those fireworks start you instantly stand up in excitement It's so hard to explain this feeling, but we had dreamt all through lockdown and what kept us going was to take Hunter to see her very first fireworks at Disney World. And this moment was even more special than we could have dreamt. Thank you. 
What do you think, Hunter? The first time seeing fireworks. Yeah, that was... Mwah. Mwah.